everyone. Welcome back to another late night talk. I always film these videos at night. I don't know why. I put my webcam. I just go ramble and I talk. And I feel like it's more nice because I'm more open to you guys. And it's more like expressing myself at night. I don't know why. It's just a thing of mine. But today I wanted to do a haul video for you guys because <laughs> I've had so many phases, I will admit. There were some points in my life where I thought like, oh my god, I like this. I'm literally going to do this forever, but then it's just a phase. So I thought I'd show you guys my different phases and the ones that I've been through. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys will definitely see these phases already. If you guys don't, make sure you do. It's at Alina Genevieve for Snapchat, Alina Genevieve for everything. It should be right down somewhere on this side. So if my first phases were these, and all these clothes are from Shein's side because I got all my clothes there. First were these pants. Now this phase was like, I was just like, ooh, I want to look very cozy, ready for winter, this and that, etc, etc. And so I got a bunch of these clothes, and this is a, a pair of high-waisted jeans. Look like this. It's like, it's striped, but you can actually feel the stripe. So that's why I was like, I'm in love. But when I first got this in the mail, it, it was so small. Look at this. Like, this is the size of, like, my waist. Like, I was like, how is this going to fit? But the thing was that it stretches really wide. And the material of the um, pant, it's very stretchy too. So I was able to get this up my legs and ready to go. The next thing that I love are these jackets. Now, I remember I showed you guys one of these before. But the difference is this one, it has like fringe. And I saw this one and I was like, okay, I can't top it up. Like, this one has fringe. So it's the same concept, same thing, but this one just has fringe at the end and I thought it was so cute so I had to get one so that's why I had two of these you know one with fringe one without so I thought that was super cute and the next one that I got is also like this one now this looks very similar to the denim one that I wore to Nicholas's Detone when I went to make Kim hair purple but except it's like let me see the sleeves are like this the sleeves are gray. This is super fucking cute. Like, I love this so much. I love this in the denim one that I have. The sleeves are gray and it's like tan leather with the hood with like really skinny strings. This I absolutely adore. I wore this in like Race of the Spectrum vlogs. So you guys definitely check that out. If you guys haven't, you'll see me wear this. Next one is, this is like a blouse. I love this blouse because it, it's so cute. It's like, let me show you guys. Arms. Arms. Wait, no. This is the arm. Wait, no. This is the arm, this is a neck piece, and it buttons up like crazy, but it has like a long string that you tie and it's like a big bow right here. So cute, I literally live for this. I Next was this baseball tee, and what I like about this baseball tee is because the neckline is so big, I can just wear it over the shoulder like how I'm doing with this shirt. So I really like this one. It's really big and loosey and I can just wear it over the shoulder, make it skanky up a little bit. I also really was into bombers, bomber sweaters, bomber jackets. So I got myself a pink one. And this one is just like a, a regular bomber or windbreaker, whatever you guys want to call it. I heard it's windbreaker. I heard it's bomber. <sighs> so many. But it has like a little thing here that's... That just reads some random crap. I doesn't it doesn't even make sense, but it's just there for decoration, I guess. But it looks like this. It's a windbreaker. I also got one in green because I don't know. I have one in black, but I was like, ooh, I've never seen one in green before, so I got one in green. So you guys might have seen me wearing this on Instagram. A lot of these clothes I wore on Instagram because those were like while I was going through my phases, but those were like the cozy winter type, but still look badass phase. And then from there, I went on to looking like a rich ass bitch. So I went to dresses and I thought to myself that, oh my God, you know what? Well, I go on so many dates with all these older men. I might as well look like a fucking fancy bitch. So I got so many dresses for so many dinner dates and I am in love with these dresses. So let me show you guys. So the first one is very, very like unexpectedly inappropriate in a way, but it looks like this. So the straps go right here. And then this one hangs over the shoulder right here. So it looks like this. And it squeezes your tits so well. Like, it makes my tits look amazing. But the thing is, it's so short. It literally stops where, like, 
I don't know, like, it stops really short. Like, when you walk, it rises up, and you can see your ass in the back. So I would wear this to, like, a club or something, not maybe, may, not to dinner, not to dinner. I don't know what I was thinking, but I saw how flowy this one was. It looks so ballerina. It looks so princess-like, so I had to get it. It looks like this. It has, like, a bunch of tulle under. No, I lied, it doesn't. It's, like, lace material. It looks so, like, elegant and just, like... Um, you know, elegant. It looks very elegant. That's all I can describe it as elegant. It has like sheer lace right here and it's black and it's poofy and it's like, it's gorgeous. Like I literally love this, but I just don't know what occasion to wear it to because it's too much for dinner. So maybe to like the Royal Castle or something. I was also into rompers. Rompers were nice because like they, they were like a two piece. And so I got one, but however, with this one, I wasn't really like, satisfied with it when it came because like the v cut is so low that like if you're flat chested or just like have small boobs this will just like fall over your tit so it's like this is nice and all but it was just too the, the v was just too deep so i might have to sew like a velcro on it to like attach it or something because the v is just way too deep i also got this dress it's really cute it's like this one's just so cute it's sheer on the top like this, and it's like, it goes down to your knees. However, the only problem with this dress was there's no zipper, there's no nothing. So your hope is to just, let's just hope the whole, like, you have to hope your shoulders can fit through this tiny little waistline, and your head is able to fit through here, and it's, I tried putting this on so many ways, I can't because there's no zipper, there's no nothing. I'm literally stuck trying to force myself into that dress, so it's gorgeous, but I can't wear it because there's no way to get in it. The next one is really cute. This one's very pinup and, like, just vintage looking. It's, like, a collar right here, and it looks like this. Do you guys see? It's, like, this is where your tit are, and then the tit right here connects up, and there's, like, a collar right there which is this one. And then the sleeves are relatively short up to here. And it has a button up right there and it's cut up. I would wear these clothes for you, but I don't know, there's just too much to dry on. But it looks, I can say that this dress looks so hot when you're wearing it because you just look like you belong on a boat. Next is this one. This one is extremely long. Like this one was very, very long. It's like past ankle. It has like a very deep V, where is it? Not a deep V, I'm, I'm exaggerating, here. It looks like this, do you guys see? Mm -hmm. That's where the boob area is, and there's two wires in here, and so they bend to your liking, but it's just like a really nice bodycon dress, but just extra long. Next is my favorite, this dress has by far been my favorite, like I love it. The material is so soft, looks like this, it is, you, it's, you can cover it, you can cover as much cleavage to your liking, and it's like cut right there at the end. So this dress looks hot. Like, I wore this and I was like, damn, I look hot. Another one is t-shirt dresses. These, this is like a simple, it's like, it goes up to like here. The line goes up to here, the t-shirt stops about here, I would say. And it goes down and it curves right here, it's like a curve and it's cut on the side for your hip to come out. So this is really cute. I dig this a lot. It's like a fucking t-shirt dress. So I was like, I want it. Now after I got out of the whole cozy winter phase, I went to the dresses and then after the dresses, I was like, these were in December and then January came, New Year's hit me and then suit shopping occurred. For those who don't know, I love suits. Like, Ever since New Year's to today, I've been wearing suits every single day if you follow me on Instagram, but I haven't posted any suit videos on YouTube because all the videos i posted on YouTube so far were filmed back in December, if you guys look at the date, but all the vlogs you guys see later on, I'm literally in a suit every day. And so, for those of you guys who wonder where I get my suits, I have seen a couple questions, and these ones I've got on Shein's side, but those ones I've got at, like, places... So first, I got this gray pant. It looks like this. It's not too long, not too short. It's I also have got these black dress pants. They're like flowing. They like tighten up down the ends, but 
These are really cute so I was like I could pair this up with so many things. This isn't suit related but I just had to get it. It looked like a, it looked so warm and cozy. It's like this big ass gray sweater and from here it's like a little shorts and there's like a little string that ties up by your waist so you look really tiny. I had to get it. As for blazers, this one is so cute. I have so many blazers of black but they look the same color but they're not. It's like this and it's flowy right here dangling and flowy and has a button up right here this was so cute i literally got another one in the color coral which is right here so it looks just like this but in black so i have one in black and one in coral do you guys see or tan or whatever you guys want to call it tan tan beige 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 not coral what the hell coral while i was there i also picked up this really fucking big ass long white the material is really thick, but it's like a blazer. These are all blazers, by the way. And this one just looks very, like, it's so long. It makes me look it makes me look all tiny. And I'm just, like, wearing this big-ass white blazer. So I'm just, like, I love this. Another one that I picked up was this one. It's, like, the exact same. Wow. It's the exact same one as the white one, but just in the coral. Just in the beige color. And it's, like, cut differently. It's, like, long in the front, but short in the back. And so I really dig that. And so those were all my collections, all my phases that I've been going through because I do go a lot. I do get a lot of. I do go through a lot of phases. However, my favorite one right now is the suits. I don't know when I'm gonna get over them, but I'm in love with them. I literally cleaned out all my closets and replaced them with suits. So I might get more suits right now. Who knows? I've been going suit shopping like crazy. Love suits. Live for them. Fuck yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this phase video that I've been going through. I was like, you know, I've been through so many phases. Everyone calls me out for it. And I might as well make a video about it. So I was like, here's a little haul of all the clothes that I get. Because all the phases that I go through are all the clothes that I get on Sheen's side. So I'm just like, here's a link to everything I got. So I'll see you guys next time. I'll leave a link to everything in the description box down below. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.